Hi, I'm Stuart from SOB Leadworks, and welcome to the next job. Let's go and have a look, see what it's all about. Okay, so here we are. We've got this um, this flat porch lead. It's just going to be a couple of bays on this, I think. Just a one wood roll bang in the middle. But what we'll do first, we'll get all the um, prep work done. So we'll take out this brick joint first, get all the mess done, and then we can sweep that away. Um, and we've also got a copper drip edge on this as well. So we'll get this copper strip nailed on 25mm lower than this timber get some building paper, some wood roll on there, and then we can get some bays. Okay, so that's that chase cut out now, and I'm just in the process now of fixing this copper copper strip all the way through, which I'm nearly there, I've just got the last side to do down there. But I'm just gonna take five minutes out because the uh, lovely customer has just made me an egg and bacon sandwich. So, um, catch you in a bit. Well, that's that egg and bacon sandwich gone. I've got to say, that was a really, really nice treat. I wasn't expecting that at all. Um, let me know in the comments section how many times that happens to you um, on jobs. That was really nice. Right, so we have now got the last bit of copper strip fixed on that side. The building paper is now on, and we have now just screwed down the wood roll. Just got one wood roll bang in the middle. Um, that works out lovely. Right, so what we're going to do now is start getting these lead bays in. I think what I'm going to do first, I think I'm going to get this side in first and um, make this the undercloak bay and then we can do that one. So I'll catch you in a bit. Okay, so that's that undercloak bay in now. I didn't go in too badly actually. It was just a little bit tricky to get it behind that, that batten there but um, just managed to get that okay so it's not too bad. Right, so now we've got that one in and that's all welded. What we're going to do now is get the overcloak bay in. Okay, so that's that overcloak bay in as well now. Just finished bossing that roll in. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna trim this splash lap. What I'm gonna do is just trim that to 50 mil. So I know what I normally do, just get a roofing square, put it against the side of the roll there. Mark that up, that'll give me 50 mil. Then when it gets to the front, I just angle it off. I just think that just look, looks a little bit nicer and then just coming straight coming straight off and plus also gives us a bit more cover as well so I'm going to get that trimmed off and then we can start looking at getting this front down okay so that's that splash lap all trimmed up now also I've just finished dressing down this front into the copper so that's all dressed down now and just turned down into the copper it gives it a nice a nice finish and not only that it secures the lead from any sort of like wind lift or anything like that and this um I just think it's just a nicer finish all round rather than rather than clips Anyway, so that's that done now. So what we've got left to do now is a few gussets. I've got one to weld in there, one there, and then the same on the other side. I've got that corner to weld there, and another gusset to weld in there. So we'll get these gussets welded in. And once we've done that, we can just look at getting this flashing done. Okay, so I've just finished welding in all these gussets now. So that's them all done. So now the only thing left to do is to have a look at this flashing. So let's get that done next. Okay, so that's that flashing in now. So the only thing left to do now is to point that in and give it a coat of oil and that'll be job done. Okay, so that's that mastic pointing all finished now. And I've just given this a coat of oil as well and that's uh, it's darkened it up lovely. So that is job done. So I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can check me out on Instagram at SOB Leadworks. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. Hopefully catch you in the next. Cheers.